Hey everyone, it's Rory. I know it's been a long time, but um, I wanted to share the speed paint of Colin Hell with Virgil. Um, this took me absolutely forever, and it absolutely took me forever to find a good face for Virgil. Like, and what's with those eyebrows? But I eventually settled, like, with this one, but those eyes weren't, like, they weren't a good fit, I guess, but, um, I did use a little bit of a reference for the hoodie, because I'm bad at drawing hoodies, but in the end, it actually came out looking good, and these eyebrows on Cole, I absolutely love them, and this part, um, I honestly really don't know how I feel about the facial hair on Virgil. I mean, originally, he was a pitch black character of rosy red cheeks and he wore suits. And then I officially changed him to the Seven Deadly Sins Greed. So he's basically Mammon, just his name's Virgil. I'm sorry if you hear any bells or anything in the background, it's my cat. But um, here is whenever I started to add a little bit of texture for the hair. Because lately I've just been trying to focus more on the hair. And sorry about the non-stop flashing, I was trying to make sure I was getting it good. Which, in the end, I don't know how I feel about the textures with the hair. But um, honestly... I, I kind of like Cole's hair, but Virgil's hair and everything about Virgil, I'm not sure about. And I was trying to give him more of like a Lafayette look from Hamilton, I guess, but I couldn't really get that. And then I forgot to add his horns, so I had to add those in later. But here you can see me just trying to add in the hair texture. And lately I've been trying to like practice with black hairstyles i haven't really tried to do those type of hairstyles before but with all of the characters like the, my characters growing i'm trying to find new hairstyles and new textures to try and honestly i do really really love the curls and it took me a moment to figure out which which brown I wanted to use for Virgil, but I ended up settling this. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about the blush, and sorry for all the dollar signs. Um, I was trying to make him seem more of greed with money, and then I decided not to add that. So here I'm just doing a bunch of, of colored shading, and I'm trying to make sure everything matches correct. Here I'm building a little brick wall in the background. And for the next part coming up, I had to use a reference for, like for a tree. But um, I added some texture to the walls to make it pop out a little bit more. I don't know if that worked. And for the trees, I was going specifically for a birch tree. And I used an oil brush an oil paint brush and I'm not sure how that worked. I hated those stripes, they were the worst. So I ended up using a texture brush in order to get the birch tree effect. I like it, but I don't know if other people will. It's just, I guess a little bit funky looking. And then I thought it was a little bit too bare. So after I shaded it, I added some leaves. But then I had to go back and redo the shading because I was on the wrong layer. I'm still, I'm honestly still working on how to shadow properly. Because I'm an artist, but I'm not the artist, you know? I don't know if that made sense, but like, I made this, but I'm still trying to figure everything out, honestly. I use different mediums with this and I was I was just trying to go for more of a me basically here I was adding the little red highlights to like go with the background basically but um here I could not figure out what type of stars to use 
And then I found one that I just made it brighter. And then I'm going in with all the red shading, even though it already has shading. And I'm making everything blend a little bit more. So this is the final piece, and I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I might post a few more speed paints in the future. I'm not really sure. I've just been busy with work, and now I go back to school in almost two weeks. All right, that's all, and I will see you all in the next video, whenever that may be. Bye-bye.